CIET NCERT presents the audio book Mridang 1 Textbook of English for class 1 Page number 75 Chapter 3 Let us sing A farm My dear grandpa had a farm E I E I O And on that farm he had a cow E I E I O With a moo moo here and a moo moo there Here a moo there a moo everywhere a moo moo My dear grandpa had a farm E I E I O My dear grandpa had a farm E I E I O And on that farm he had a hen E I E I O With a cluck cluck here and a cluck cluck there Here a cluck there a cluck everywhere a cluck cluck My dear grandpa had a farm E I E I O On this page we have two pictures showing grandpa's farm with all the lovely animals like horse dog hens cow etc Replace the animals with their sounds and continue the rhyme Use the sounds of animals from your language for example cat meow meow Page number 76 Let us do Color the farm and name the animals in the farm use this help box help box cat cow goat pig hen cock sparrow we have a big picture for you to color all the animals are shown in the picture page number 77 let us read animals and birds My name is Jaggu. I live in Nagpur. Come with me. I will tell you about the animals that live near my house. This is a dog. It lives near the gate. In this picture we have a dog standing next to Jaggu. The dog and Jaggu are seen near the gate. Page number 78. These are cats. They jump up and down in the veranda of my house. Here we see a picture of two cats who are jumping up and down in the veranda. This is a cow. It eats grass. Here we have the picture of a cow. Page number 79. This is a rat. The rat is very small. The cat chases the rat. Here we have a picture of a cat trying to chase and catch the rat. These are monkeys. They swing and jump in the trees. Here we see a picture of a tree with three monkeys sitting on the tree. There is a field beside my house. There are a few snakes in it. You have to walk carefully in the field here we see a picture of two snakes in the field page number 80 now i will also tell you about the birds i see near my house this is a crow it is black in color this is a pigeon it is gray in color this is a sparrow it is a small bird This is a parrot. It is green and has a red beak. This is a peacock. It has many colors. I love animals and birds. Here we have a picture that shows so many different birds like crow, pigeon, sparrow, parrot and peacock. New words: veranda, cow, rat. sparrow crow pigeon snake fields peacock beak note to the teacher 
1. Talk about animals, birds and insects that live in your surroundings. 2. Through frequent and regular repetition, reinforce the English names of the animals, birds and insects. Page number 81. Let us speak. A. Do you know that some animals live in the jungle? Look at the pictures and say the names. There are three pictures given here. Picture 1. Tiger. Picture 2. Lion. Picture 3. Elephant. B. Say the word rat. Say it again. Notice that the last sound of the word rat is T. Now, say the words given below. Cap. Jam. Pen. Bell. What is the last sound that you hear in each word spoken above? Note to the teacher. 1. Help children understand the concept of domestic and wild animals. 2. Help children notice the final sounds of the words given above. Page number 82. C. Talking in pairs. Child 1. What is the colour of a parrot? Child 2. A parrot is... Dash. Child 1. What is the colour of a crow? Child 2. A crow is... Dash. Child 1. What is the colour of a rat? Child 2. A rat is... Dash! Child 1 What is the colour of a peacock? Child 2 Oh, it has many colours! Here we see two friends, two kids from the school, sitting on the branch of a tree and talking about different birds and animals. Note to the teacher. The objective of the above activities is to encourage conversation and develop the child's confidence in speaking English. Help children frame sentences using the above sentence structure. Page number 83 Fun time! We have a big beautiful picture given here of a room. There is a computer on the table. Next to that we see a flower vase and a bed. Now comes the fun part, kids. We see an elephant outside the window. But we also see the elephants on a painting hanging on the wall, a cloth bag hanging on the wall, the bed sheet, the cushions. So many elephants in one picture. Note to the teacher. 1. Help children locate the elephants at different places. 2. Help them use prepositions such as in, on, behind, etc. 3. Ask children about other details in the picture for interaction and developing speaking skills. You were just listening to this audiobook, Mridang 1. Artists, Gaurav Marwaha and Richa Seyal. Technical coordinator, Bati Langdingdo. Sound recordist, Vikas Sangwan. Assistance in production, Minakshi Kukreti. Produced by Bimlesh Chaudhary. This audiobook is presented to you by CIET NCERT, New Delhi, India.